This is Steph from Stella Dog Gallery. Hi. How are you? I'm very well. Yourself? Yeah, I'm good. Getting there. Getting there. I mean, this is this is location for you, but you, your gallery was based just down the road. Here, just yeah, it? just down the road. So for those of you who don't know, Stella Dog Gallery is is primarily a uh, platform for uh, merging urban street graffiti based artists, and you've got some serious like contenders inside the ride, haven't you? Really? Um, yeah, I've been very lucky. Who have you had on? What with the with the gallery yeah, uh, been in? exhibition, we've got Ben Ein, um, Noki, who you've, I believe you've had on That's your podcast. My guy. <laughs> yeah, um, a big up iron as well. Yeah, absolutely. Is it about finding a new talent and nurturing the, the kings? I think it's about rewarding the people that have put the legwork into yeah. into the culture because you see, especially with street art, a lot of people that you know they might have put one or two stencils up around this area and yeah. then they they're suddenly trying to sell a screen print or artwork. Whereas you've got someone like Ben yeah. that have put years and years into it at their own cost, um, and I think it's about getting those people. Yeah, um, you know, um, selling work. We have a multi-talented character, Bice One, aka Pablo, photographer Dreamboat. <laughs> How are you? I'm all right, thank you very much. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for it's a pleasure. Nice I've, one, I've mate. been a fan for a minute. Cheers, you know I mean? cheers. Um, what we got going on here then? What's happening? Um, so this uh, wall's actually something that I've actually wanted to do for a very long time. And it's basically the work I do as a photographer and the topic I'm involved in right now, which is migration. Yeah. Um, and so all these words were picked or selected from during trips I have yeah. uh, you know, conducted with yeah. people that I've been traveling with from Central America. I used to f photograph in different formats using film, but yeah. it's not feasible. No. So, and I feel comfortable. It's not feasible. I don't have the money to be a film photographer. I don't yeah. really mind the feel to the work. Mm. Um, I'm not so much of a technical person and I'm happy like that, yeah. but um, I just want the immediate results to, to assess what I'm doing and uh, I think digital photography does it for me. The camera can be a barrier, it can be a block and it can make you be, you know, stand out as, as a photographer and I want to not stand out as a photographer because I'm touching on a very you know, sensitive topic mm -hmm. that, that I don't want to be perceived as the outsider, although mm -hmm. I am. I'm mm. an outsider, you know, but when so using the cameras I use helps a lot to like blend blend in from some sort of perspective. Obviously, with the graph background, oh, there's going to be people there that will know you from from the graffiti world. Probably, yeah, yeah, you yeah. know, there'll be people that also know you from the photography side. Um, I think Stella Dor, as as a as a as a PR agency that that helps like bridge those creative things together and gives like a, a platform I mean tell us your relationship with, with that collective and um, what's your um, opinion of the of the project of uh, the gallery all, all, all I can say is that she's been very supportive of things that I've been wanting to do this is an example of that yeah I was actually thinking about it while I was in the process of just getting it started I, what I think about Steph is that she actually um, She's convinced that she she knows that there's, there's certain players in this in this game that have done have contributed mm. to the scene and that probably not always get recognition yeah. by the main curators and and wh whatever you know and I think that it's uh, with with the strength that characterizes her and and the passion she has for yeah. graffiti for instance. Yeah is that she's made things happen. And this, this, this wall's thanks to her and my sister and, and, and then a few other actors uh, that have been involved in, in me coming to Britain and, and doing this. So, you know, but in terms of Steph, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm very, really grateful. Yeah, for, that's fine. For and you're her. absolutely right as well. And I'm not saying that just because she's over there. <laughs> <laughs> thanks very much, mate. The mighty Vice yeah, One, cool. Pablo inside the ride. Cheers, mate. Peace. <laughs>